guys to the barbecue sauce barbecue sauce all right barbecue sauce because daddy love my barbecue sauce so we're gonna make it again see you guys here is the ingredients there's a lot in here there's a lot going on in the barbecue sauce so Okay, she said that she is my helper. What's your name, helper? Uh, I'm the boss around here. Oh, you are the boss around here. Okay, okay. I uh, want this in salt sauce. You do? You like yeah, it's my cup. Yeah. It's a salt cup I buy. Uh, yeah. Because I want it. Okay. And it's have a smelly bee. I don't have that. You can use, I think, olive oil if you don't like butter. Or vegetable oil if you want. But... I use butter because it have more flavor in it. Mm. Yeah, cinnamon make the Sauce. the the barbecue sauce really smell good. Onion, it's a white onion. Hey, it make people cry. I use white onion because it's not that strong. Cause red onions kinda kinda strong has a strong flavor, and so I use this kind of. Hey, onion. this make people cry. Yeah, onion make people cry. And have here yeah, also. Onion. I think it's five cloves of garlic. Garlic. Yes, five cloves. So now, after this one, we're gonna make a barbecue sauce. See ya! Goodbye. Now we're making our. What are we making? Barbecue sauce. sauce. Barbecue sauce. Barbecue sauce. We put over cook, just melt that butter. Okay. Hey, can I the wallet? You sure? It's too far. Yeah. It'll move the hand. Okay. She wants to learn how to cook, so I let her help. Huh? My hand is warm. Let me teach you how to see that you put it there and you do this. That's how you do it. Okay. Okay, now the butter is melted. We're gonna put our garlic. Don't overcook the garlic and the... Uh, can I mix it? Yeah, I can mix it. Like that. Hey, can you put me a little bit closer? Hold on. No, what's like this? Okay. No, what's like that? The way the way it's Oh, it's closer. Okay, that's good. I will get so fine. See that? Let's do that now. Okay. Put it in a low heat right here. Low. In a low heat? Yeah. Because I want to mix it. Yeah. Now we're gonna add our white onion. Can I mix it? Can I mix it? Okay, you mix it. Mm. Careful. Extra careful because it's hot. Baba said, What's my for the cake? Okay, mommy's going, please. Okay, because I'm the boss. Don't burn your onion and your garlic. Keep stirring it. Keep stirring it. In Wohita? Yeah. 
Why so much bubbles? Because it's being hot already. Okay, that's good. See that? Good already. Now we're gonna add our tomato ketchup. No, it's tomato. Yeah, tomato ketchup. <laughs> I forgot because we look alike. Okay, tomato sauce. This is tomato sauce. Well, it don't matter. It's tomato sauce. So hold it now. They're both. Look at the camera. Don't move it. Well, okay. Thank you. Well, okay. Okay, this is the tomato sauce. What? And we cook this one at least two minutes. What's going on? We have to cook the tomato tomato sauce for Hi, two minutes. Hey, what's going on? For cooking that. What's going on? Why stop? Stop what? Yes. I put in a little flame. Well, yes, it's low. While it's cooking for two minutes, I'm gonna off the camera. Now the two minutes is up. Now we're gonna off the flame. Off so the flame. we can add the rest of the ingredients. It's still okay. Hold the camera now. We will get mommy gonna add the ingredients. And you hold the camera. You hold the camera. And I mix it. Yeah. Here is the. Hey! Ketchup! That's the tomato ketchup. Hey, I'm standing right. I stand it good. That's good. Hold on. Don't move too much. Don't move your camera and don't shake it too much. Also. Those people are gonna get dizzy when they watch this. Okay? I know. That's the ketchup. Then. They want. Then. Apple cider. The Bob Apple Cider. Ah, George made it. George made it? Yeah. George made it last time that was. Then, next is. Tell you how we up. I will see The more. brown sugar. The brown sugar. Then the honey, the f and of course, all the spices, the ground spices are here. I put them together. Okay, here's it. We we'll then dump in there. Wait, we're gonna on the flame again. And we're gonna stir this one. Mommy, first in you. And we're gonna stir this one until they mix together. It's my turn. Until mommy's finished. Mix them together. It's gonna be me? Yeah, it's gonna be you next. <laughs> until they mix together. You can put it now in high flame. Until it become until boiled. Can I stir it? So it start boiling. Let's stir it. Wait on that one, please. No matter stop you. You have to break down the the what do you call this one? The lumps in there. My time. So you have to keep mixing this. After the lumps gone. Then you can let it boil in low flame until it turns really thick. Once it turns really thick, then you're done. And you can use it to make a chicken barbecue. I'm gonna show you how to make my chicken barbecue after this. Okay, now it's the yard's turn. Go ahead. You always wanna learn how to cook. 
because my ears is so stuck up. I can't hear. I got real bad sign. Don't say that in the video. Oh, sorry. I can't see it in the video. I apologize. She said I can't see it that I have a bad You're done? And yet it's still long. It's four minutes. Four minutes. She said it needs four minutes. Okay, I think that's good. Let me see. What you made? See, it's still liquid. You see that? It's still runny. Nothing? When it's done, it's not be runny like this. It's gonna be thick. I'll show you later. For now, I'm gonna close the camera off. Wait a minute, I forgot my white vinegar. I need vinegar, my helper is gone. So I'm gonna put the tablespoon of vinegar. This is the white vinegar, it's different from the apple cider. One. Two. You still can add a one if you got because it's still not thick, it's still boiling. It's fine. This is this if you want to make a barbecue sauce. This one's really good. Okay, here is it. It's almost thick. Look. See that? It's looking yummy already. Maybe you can even use this one to dip your chicken. You have a grilled chicken, you can dip it in here. Or you can rub this one in your grilled chicken to make a barbecue chicken. See this guys is almost ready. See that? See that? It's almost thick already. See? It's not too runny no more. Always keep the low flame. Don't put it high so she's gonna you're gonna burn it. See? Low. Low. After it's done you can put some salt to taste. Put salt as much as you desire. If you want it too salty, it's up to you. <laughs> but it's good enough, so it'll be better. And I use the black pepper mel. Black pepper mel because it got more kick on this one have more kick than the ground pepper. See the it got granules in this one. It's not really powdery because it's a paper mel. Okay, now here is the sauce. It's thick already, see? Thick. It's now done.
And we're gonna we're gonna off the flame. And we're gonna add the salt to taste. This is how how I put my salt like that. Eyeball only. Eyeball measurement. Now uh, here's the pepper mill. Eyeball measurement also. You can add what you want after you taste it. So we're gonna taste this one first. You can put this one in the fridge for at least I think seven days. But if you put but if you put this in the freezer you can make at least one month but it won't last long enough because we use this one every single day. Use this one every single day because my husband loves chicken and he likes barbecue. So here now we'll taste it. Okay, perfect. Really tastes good. It's perfect. That's enough salt. I don't need to put more salt or pepper. I'm gonna show you how I make my barbecue chicken. Okay, here. You see this? A chicken thigh right here I don't I didn't put no oil under there because the chicken see this I don't take the fat of the chicken when I make my barbecue chicken in the pan so that's gonna be my oil in there so I got three thighs in here each thigh I'm gonna put one tablespoon of barbecue sauce see that that's how I make my chicken barbecue like that see it then after I'm gonna add water okay here's my water when I add my water I only put the water label up to the chicken see this like that yeah like that that's it like that that's how we that's the way I cook my barbecue chicken then after I leave that one here and cook this one for 30 minutes 30 minutes and I use this electric stove I put the one first on high on high then when this one start boiling then I put the one here in number three see this when it start boiling but now it's not burning so put in high so I leave it like that and I'll show you later what happened next this one in here in the jar this is a glass jar because I only put this one in the fridge but if you want to put this one in the freezer don't use glass jar you can use plastic jar or any kind of jar that the that, that hold the freezing of the the ice of the freezer
almost full. Okay, that's it for my barbecue sauce. Okay, see this guys is already boiling. Boiling to death. Now, I'm gonna move this one in number 3. And cook this for 30 minutes. Start the day. It's already on the side of the pot. Now I'm gonna flip this. Flip over. You keep shaking this one. You keep flipping this. Keep flipping this. Keep flipping this. And because this water will tell you later what it looks like when it's done. Now I'm gonna cover it. This is a non-stick pan and I don't gonna cover so I'm using this kind of cover. Now it's smoking. Now we're gonna flip this one again. When you cook this one, you keep an eye, you keep an eye on this, so it won't burn. Also, but if you like it burn, that's fine. But kaning americano dili ganahan o pa eggs. Ang americano dili ganahan pa eggs, so what you say? We keep an eye on this. What you say about me? Ang americano dili ganahan o pa eggs. Sounds about right. <laughs> that like burn food. I like burn food. <laughs> you want me to kick your ass? Huh? <laughs> Do you? We'll it. <laughs> right. It's almost done. Check it out. See the sauce is almost get thicker and thicker. Zombie. Zombie pencil. Everybody wants a zombie pencil. The post apocalyptic zombie pencil. That sauce is almost so thick already, see? When that one starts getting thick, then it's done. It starts to thick the big room. And also, I forgot to tell you that this chicken is being brined. So. Got more flavor in it already. I brine this one with salt for six hours. These are so much. These are so much fun. I used to make these all the time in school. I started it, and other people followed. What's that? <laughs> I used to make these all the time when I was a kid. These are called post-apocalyptic -apoc zombie pencils. I used to make these all the time when I was in school. I started it, then another uh, sheep followed it. Another <laughs> sheep. <laughs> Baba. Baba. <Yeah. laughs> these, are, these are fun to make. If anybody wants to sheep one of these, go ahead and sheep it. These are, these are fun to make, fun to use in school. Your teacher be You're like, the pencil. Your teacher, you can still sharpen that and everything. There's nothing wrong with that pencil. And the more you sharpen it, even these big pieces that are missing, you can sharpen right up to that and still use it. The teacher would be like, what happened to that pencil? Come to survive the Holocaust. Guys, it's done. See this? The skin is already kind of brown. It means it's done. See the sauce? Oh God. But you can it make it more drier if you like, but my husband like it like really like this. So he can dip the chicken in that sauce. Don't like it dry. See that oil? That's why I don't put no oil in this one. Because the chicken have a lot of oil already.
So that's how I make my barbecue chicken. Juicy and tender. A lot of sauce in it. Okay, he's eating his barbecue now. I eat one also. Then eat a lot. So, what can you say about this barbecue chicken that I cook for you every day? It's really good. I actually got the the good barbecue sauce. To pose the question again. <laughs> what can you say about the barbecue sauce? What can I say about this barbecue sauce? Yeah. One word. Delish is the three syllables. <laughs> That's why he got he want a lot of sauce in there so he can dip the rice in it's the sauce. It's still hot now, but it'll cool down a little bit more. It just come off the oven or stove oven. Mean. He can finish that big bowl of rice, are you? No, I'm gonna finish that big bowl of rice. <laughs> You're an Asian, right? No. No dummy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Oriental. <laughs> <laughs> <The> Oriental. <laughs> Oh, it's Asian dummy. Asian dummy. The, they're on that movie. Yeah. People don't know what that means because yeah. they've never seen the movie. Okay. No, it's Oriental dummy. <laughs> 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 okay, rice and barbecue sauce.